Hey guys, going to show you the uh, four-wheel drive TK system. This TK comes on the Gen 5 drivetrains, so a lot of you guys will end up with them. And now it's a possibility to use them. Here's uh, the control unit that you'll mount in your vehicle. Again, this this is a factory control unit. You know, from 15 to I assume 2019. Right now we're in two-wheel drive, so I'm gonna set this down and. I'm turning this so I can hold this stationary. And you see we got a direct connection. These are spinning at the same speeds. We're now gonna go to four high. You see down here in the scanner, everything is actuating. So now we got a bit more tension on it, but now this can't I can't hold the output of that. So, like I said, nice and solid, this is going to your front diff. Now we're going to go to four low. All right. So now look at this. You see how fast that reduction is. So now this is nice and slow. And this is our uh, three, I don't know the exact reduction but it's in a three to one ratio and the buzzing noise that will go away after you use a solid state relay um, there's internal clutches in this and that allows for a smooth engagement um, this has all the built-in safeties it only work in neutral so you, you can't really tear it up it comes one of the few wires you'll actually hook up this will be your VSS into your computer this way, the T case will output VSS to your computer. So, once in four low, it will shift correctly. Um, the rest of it is plug and play. There's only four wires that go on the inside, and that's ignition, ground, and your CAN bus. I'll show you real quick what the module looks like. This is the T case module. Then, I've sourced all these connectors so it plugs in just like factory can't mess it up and this will be the interface connector basically it just hooks up to your OBD2 connector or you can hardwire it and that's really all you got that module the controls and then the hard part was really this research and development of it and building the harness there's there's a lot of wires and uh, interfacing it had to do and now we got the additional relay but um, like I said this is really cool it all works. It should work in Gen 4s as well. It's really just, it really just needs a transmission to know it's a neutral. So a 6 to 8 neutral signal would be the same. And we'll put it back in a too high. And now you can see how easy it moves. So I'm uh, trying to produce a bunch of these right now. Um, most I have five sets, so I have a few for sale. Um, the rest are, are um, spoken for. But um, here's a system, and just another thing that we have working for this stuff. Thanks for watching. Bye.